everybody what's up welcome back to my channel so today we will be unboxing a new aircraft which is the Indian Airlines Airbus A320 I got this from DB Jets and this aircraft is made by Hogan Wings landing gear is included and it's a scale 1 by 200 it's made by solid plastic and a clip to a stand and landing gears can be removed so let me tell you some more about Indian Airlines it has been operating since 1953 and has merged with Air India in 2011 and I'm very happy I got this aircraft because you know this is a vintage livery model and it's like my first time I'm getting this type of aircraft so let's go to the back of the box you can see their specifications the wingspan length and height both in meters and inches and feet uh, okay so basically I got the aircraft which is at the bottom when I unboxed the aircraft before the video I noticed that it was a normal livery with the registration Victor Tango dash Echo Yankee Hotel maybe next time if you want to see the unboxing for this video I will try to get this model next time and if you want to buy this model do visit GB, DB Jets website, which will be given in the description below. So here are some things given. It's highly detailed, simple snap fit construction, no painting required, and display stand included. Let's unbox the parts of the aircraft one by one. Yeah. So basically I got the stand but there's nothing written on it. It's kind of small but it's I have done it something like this before. And here are the landing gears which I always get with any Hogan Wings aircraft. And here we have the fuselage of the aircraft. It's very nice. I like the color of it. And it's actually taped very nicely, so you gotta be a little careful when opening it. So we got it. The fuselage of the aircraft of the Airbus A320. Written both in Hindi and English. So let's review the fuselage first. We have the first door, the emergency exits, and the back door. The Airbus A320 and the registration. Actually, I would like to thank the YouTube channel Space for Everyone because he or she was the one who told me the the full form of each aviational letter. letter. So yeah, then behind we have the auxiliary power hole. It's kind of good, you know, not like any other aircraft I had brought before. So same thing on the other side, except it's written here in English. And we have the cockpit in the front. It's like very old-fashioned way. Yeah, so let's continue unboxing more aircraft. Let me make this clear. Okay, so guys, we have un we are now going to unbox the wings of the aircraft and the stabilizers on the tail. So the registration is written on the top. And for the other wing, it's written on the bottom. Yeah. The engines do spin. Any aircraft by Hogan Wings, the engine spins, but which is only the 1x200 scale. Then I have the stabilizers. There are actually two of them. Yeah. And at last but not least, the brightly colored tail fin. Looks so good. I like the aircraft weight, this livery. And Let's continue unboxing, which will be done after the break. Hey guys, thanks for visiting me once again. I want to show you something new that I've started inserting posts to my videos, so do answer them. Hey, and don't forget to check my most popular video with a stunning 1.7k views. Do share your comments below, and I would like to look forward for 100 subscribers. If you like it, do like, subscribe, turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss out my latest videos. Let's continue unboxing guys. Alright, 
everybody it's time to finish the aircraft model i already built it for you guys to save some time now it's time to unbox the landing gears which is my favorite part you see this is the nose gear and the wing gears and this is the nose holder let's open it slowly you must know one thing guys because you know the parts are very delicate including the stabilizers the tail and the wings but the most delicate part here is the landing gear because the plastic is thin. Okay guys, so all the parts are together. Now let me show you how to fix the landing gears. Let's start with the nose. So before you head on to fixing the nose landing gear, you gotta place the holder first, which is right here. It goes actually before you place the landing gear. It's kind of delicate and very sensitive, so be careful with it handling this then you put this on top the landing gear the nose wheel kind of takes time for you to fix it and here we go almost near way i'm struggling to actually ah yes it's done finally we fixed the nose gear guys that was so challenging for me the most challenging part now let us fix the wing gears so we're gonna put this yeah it should be on the right place so yeah again guys this is sensitive so be careful when you're placing this thing on it might break also so yeah the first landing gear is done now the other side now again be careful and be sensitive with this Oh, sorry guys. Yep, that's it. Okay guys, after a lot of hard work, I finally fixed the landing gears for the aircraft. Even the back wheel. Unfortunately, I cannot lift it now because you know the landing gears will fall down. So I decided to keep it still and let's review the aircraft slowly. So let's review the wings because I already reviewed the fuselage. So on the wings and the engine, we have the Air Indian Airlines logo. Then we have the escape line over on the wing. Then on the stabilizers, the same thing. It's also very detailed. And we have the red navigation light on this side. And on the other side, we actually have a green navigation light over there so by the way this aircraft is very very detailed i love it so much even though it's very old old livery like this livery was not there anymore like nine years ago it stopped so i still love it and i love collecting vintage aircrafts now as I promised you the final part, we will be fixing the stand. So let me bring this a little back. Okay. So basically the stand is not that delicate. And along with the stand, you get landing gear replacements. Or I must say the plane, the landing gear replacements for the plane during flight mode. If you don't are not interested to put the landing gears on well I always like putting the landing gears so I rarely use the replacements but do check out my 787 8 video where I couldn't use landing gears because it didn't come along with the aircraft it was an Air Indian aircraft and I also got that from DB jets now it's time to fix the aircraft to the stand Alright guys, the aircraft model is finally ready. Do you like it? Well, I like it. If you do, then give a like and type in the comment section below. What do you feel of this aircraft? Do you really want to buy it? Do ask me questions below in the comments and see you next time in another video. So, okay guys, thanks for watching. Bye!